Hello everyone! I'm back with another 85 by 11 process video. I used the Scraptastic Club, f uh, no, not free falling, shake it off kit, the November kit. And I'm going to scrapbook this photo of my stepdaughter. She's doing a handstand with the beautiful mountains behind her, and it's so her. And I'm going to stitch down that little vellum banner, and I'm going to put the rub on on it after. And so everything is the kit except the vellum and that floss. I'm just having a look here to see. Yeah. Um, oh, and a few enamel dots I put on at the end. And so um, I'm just going to get that all stitched down. And I put a little bit of uh, adhesive and then put the floss down and then tape, tape the end down with um, washi tape. I put a bit of adhesive because I don't trust for years and years that that washi tape is going to kind of stay down there. So I always put a, I try to remember to put a bit of adhesive. And so I'm getting the happy, happy, happy rub down, rub on down on that banner. Uh, these rub ons go on really nicely. And so I'm going to get my pieces together. Oh yeah, there's my fun foam I love so much again. So I'm just going to um, pop up the top left corner. And that noted, I guess it's a placemat. It's not really a tag. I ran that through my um, my cuddle bug with just that, uh, like a big dot shape. Yeah, polka dot. And so I just wanted more texture. And the background paper as well, I, I scored it on my scoreboard from left to right where the line was on the... Um, on the paper and so it just gives you more texture right I guess I'm all about the texture because I'm constantly trying to add more texture to my layouts and so I'm gonna yeah the glue dots are not gonna grab that that washi tape there so I'm gonna I'm gonna grab my glue bottle here in a second and pop up the top of that little tag that little tag comes from there you go that little embellishment and it, it stuck in there pretty good but I used my Cricut tool and just ripped it out of there and it was it's a pretty little tag so and so I'm glad that I I got that out of there and these butterflies are so pretty that come in the kit too so I'm gonna use my tool there to fluff it up a little bit bring the wings up and get that down in the right corner and I'm gonna fuss with these tags a little bit here so the now I'm gonna work on the top left hand corner here and I cut it out of the video because it ended up changing I didn't like the way that I did it so but you'll see how it ended up in the final page in the photos at the end so I'm gonna get this rub on that says I love everything about this and so I'm thinking I'm gonna put it in the top left but like I say that's that's gonna that's gonna change so I'm gonna skip ahead here and that's how I had it but I, I really didn't like it so I just left this part in so you could see me pull up the page and show you a close-up of it and so the photo there's the final photo of the top left part I used my notebook punch and just switched it up a bit and that little diamond mimics the, the triangles. And that's the finished page. So this is just the photos to look at, a few photos. And thank you everyone for watching and subscribing.